All right, guys, part two of my project. I actually bought this whole whip off of eBay. The 1M bumper, the, the most of the aftermarket 1M bumpers that uh, a lot of these body shops, I mean, a lot of these custom bumper, aftermarket bumper companies have, they have, they offer their own lip kit, but I think it's like additional $300. So I was like, I'm figuring, I'm pretty sure I can take any three series lip and modify it. So I found this flat one on eBay, but I noticed it has these little things that I think fits under the M3 bumper, but it doesn't fit under the 1M bumper. So I'm actually gonna cut this so the lip lay flats, because if I use this, it actually sits too low and I want it to sit more flush. So I'm gonna use this, this um, hyper tough cutting tool to cut it off. These things chip all the time. So I'm gonna go try to find myself some protective eyewear. I gotta work quick because I'm in the backyard by the garden and when it gets dark, the mosquitoes start to come off. All right, guys, probably not the cleanest works area you guys have ever seen, but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, right? So this is the lip right here, and I believe these right here go because the M3 has that little curve on the bottom, but I took them off because I want the, the lip to lay flat. So of course it looks kind of ugly, but once it's underneath the car, you won't be able to tell. I mean, not bad for a hundred dollar bumper. We can go test fit it and see how it looks. This bracket was right here too. So there was, I think a total of three of these braces things. So I'm just gonna do your typical, like use these hose to mount it and we'll see how it looks. All right guys, the sun is going down so I have to make this quick. Um, I really don't have anyone to hold it while I'm mounted. So this might be a test fit. It might be end up being cricket, who knows. I'm gonna try my best. All right guys, so this is the end result to the lip install. I will admit when I bought this bumper, I, I mean bought this lip, um, I did not measure it at all. So I honestly were thinking like all three series, four series or whatever, two series, one series. Lip are pretty identical besides the shape, but I think for a hundred dollars spent, it's not bad. What I'm gonna do is just create a piece to fill in this gap right here and then uh, I should be good, and I'm just gonna maybe flat black it. I hate the fact that I'm gonna lose the shine. Um, I think it sits pretty flush for um, a DUI lip, and, uh, uh, and I noticed you guys see that crack. This bumper came like that. Thank you, UPS. I mean, United States Postal Service. This is how it looks from the side. If I would have bought this from the actual creator of the bumper, it would have been like $400 for this lip. So I think for $100 spent, it turned out pretty well.